to show you how to teach the spin trick using food luring. Start by placing the food treat in your closed fist or between your fingers. Bring your hand close to your pet, then slowly lure outwards the same side as your luring hand. Click and treat the moment your pet has completed the spin. When your pet is becoming easily lured, start luring empty-handed, clicking and rewarding the moment he completes the spin. Once your pet is easily lured into a spin, it's time to add the verbal cue. You can use a different cue for each direction if you'd like. I'm going to use just one cue. Here's how you do it. Say your verbal cue, spin, then your pet will either spin like you've practiced or look lost. If he spins, click and treat. No need to release with this one since the behavior has already finished. If your pet does not spin, wait spin. one whole second, then lure the spin, click and treat, Good and go boy. back and practice luring a few more times before trying the verbal cue again. Once your pet can spin on verbal cue, you can work on proofing the behavior by teaching your dog how to spin while under distractions or in a different place. Check out my video on proofing for more information on how to train a solid, reliable behavior. Work on the trick when you have a free moment. You can ask for a spin during playtime or even while waiting for the microwave. Here's a tip. Spinning a lot can be dizzying and hard on the joints. Be sure to keep these training sessions short. Don't ask for too many spins in a row or even reverse the spin direction once in a while. Thanks for watching. For more information or any questions, check out our free Facebook training group. You can even post videos of your own training for feedback. Stay positive, practice lots, and remember to work at your pet's pace. Happy spinning!